I'm going to show you how to make a corn and black bean salad with mango and avocado that I just know is going to become your favorite salad of all time. And the reason I say that is because I've never met anyone who doesn't love this salad and you can make it in minutes. And you start with a can of black beans, 19 ounce can that you drained and rinsed. Then you're going to add one red bell pepper chopped up and a 14 ounce can of crunchy corn drained. I like the one that's called Summer Crisp. Then I'm going to add a diced mango and make sure it's ripe. This is one small container of grape tomatoes that I cut into quarters. And half a cup of chopped green onions. It's already looking really colorful. My favorite ingredient in the whole world, avocado. So this is one large avocado that I've cubed. And the dressing is really simple. I'm just going to squeeze the juice of one lime and that's going to help prevent the avocado from going brown. So it's probably about two tablespoons of lime juice and I hope you're writing all this down because I'm telling you it's going to be your favorite salad ever. Trust me on this one. So that's the lime juice. About a tablespoon of olive oil. Alrighty. Black pepper. I think I can make this in under 60 seconds. And just a little bit of sea salt, maybe, I don't know, a quarter of a teaspoon, you don't need too much. And then what I like to add for zip is some chili powder, just an eighth of a teaspoon. And they have this new chili powder you can buy called Chipotle chili powder, so if you like spicy food, get that one. Just an eighth of a teaspoon. I know an eighth doesn't seem like much, but it's a strong spice and it really makes a difference. And then an eighth of a teaspoon of ground cumin. Those are spices that you'd have on hand if you were making chili. And the last ingredient is cilantro, and it really makes the salad. So if you don't like cilantro, then you and I can't be friends. I'm just joking. You could use parsley, but it wouldn't be the same. So this is probably about two tablespoons of chopped fresh cilantro. You can chop it as fine or as coarse as you like. Big pieces are stronger, and the smaller pieces you won't get the flavor as much. So that's good. Okay, how easy was that? That's it. Now you just have to mix it. And the thing I love about this salad is it's so fresh tasting. And it's really a meal in itself, but if you wanted to, you could add grilled shrimp or grilled chicken and make it a complete meal. So there you go. How's that look? Pretty good? If you like this recipe, there are a lot more just like it in our Eat, Shrink, and Be Merry cookbook. Now I'm going to go eat. Let's eat. Drink it in